Hi, this is Leslie. In this video, we'll review the process of setting up the export of events from Reserve Cloud to a Google Calendar. To set this feature up, we're going to go down to Settings. Then we're going to click on Users. And we're going to click on Manage my Google Calendar Event Export Settings. Quite a mouthful there. Once in, we're going to go ahead and click Connect to Google Calendar. Again, this is a one-time setup. The first time you set this up or the first time the feature is accessed, Reserve Cloud will request access to your Google account. I'll go ahead and allow this. Once that authorization is granted, you'll be prompted to either export events or functions. Events is going to be the most typical and most common choice. Functions could be chosen if your organization books events that span weeks or months, but I'll just go ahead and, and uh, export those based on the event business type. I'll click Next. Now I'll put in a description of my calendar. For this calendar, I will just call this, this my test calendar. Let's spell that. And then I'm going to choose a Google Calendar so I can select from my list if I have existing Google Calendars or I could create a new Google Calendar by checking this box. Lastly, I may want to add some kind of criteria such as which events should be exported over into my Google Calendar. Minimally, I may want to at least have the site be one of my filter criteria. So I'm just going to choose that. I'm going to say my site equal to, and I'm just going to choose a site that I typically use. That filter is now in existence, but I could certainly filter by other means as well, such as salesperson, etc. I'll go ahead and save that. It's going to let me know that the calendar has been successfully added and those actual events are going to go ahead and export. This may take up to an hour to complete and I can check the status on my home page down in the background activities. So I'm going to click on done. I could check my home page real quickly here to see if by chance those uh, background activities are already initialized and they are. So once that's complete, it will let me know that here in the results. And that is all I need to do to get my Google Calendar export set up through Reserve Cloud. Again, this is a one way export. It goes from Reserve Cloud over to Google Calendar. The exported events to Google Calendar maintain events or functions with a start date within the last three months. And when this initial export that I just did is set up, all the matching events or functions in the past three months will be exported. As time moves on, and events scheduled more than three months ago will remain in Google Calendar, but if you make changes to them, uh, they will not be exported again from Reserve Cloud. So hopefully that gives you an idea of how quickly you guys can get set up with Google Calendar. Thanks for watching.